Hello there, how can you can convert XML to JSON in Python? If you are watching this video, chances are that you are writing a Python program and you have some information in an XML file and you need to convert this information to JSON. In this video, I will show you four different ways of converting XML to JSON. We will use four different libraries to do so. So without further to do, let's get started. Let's start with XML. So as you probably know, XML is a markup language that allows us to define a document and the structure of the information inside that document. Let's see this with an example. Let's say, for instance, that you want to save information about the employees in a company. The information that we are interested in is the employee's name, the role and the age. Let's translate this into XML. So we have an employees tag and inside there are several employees. And each employee has a name tag, then a role tag and also an age tag. Now how can we translate this into JSON? In this video we are going to see different ways to convert XML to JSON using different libraries available in Python. First, we will see how to convert from XML to JSON using the XML to dict library. We will also see another library called Untangle. Next, we will see how to convert from XML to JSON using the Pandas library. And last, how to do the conversion using the beautiful SOAP library. So in total, four different ways of converting XML to JSON. Perfect. Let's start with the XML to DIT library. Python doesn't include this library as a built-in library, meaning that the first thing we need to do is installing the library using pip. So let's open a new file and I will import the XML to DIT library and also the JSON library. And now I will call the parse method and this method will convert any given XML to a Python object. And next, I will add here the XML with the employee's information. This will return a Python object. So now I can use the json.dump method to convert the Python object to JSON. And I will print this as well. So let's run this. Um, perfect we have converted our XML to JSON. In many cases, you will find that XML might be saved in a file. For example, let's save our XML in a file called data.xml. So now to access the XML, first we need to open the file. And in this case, I will call the variable my file and then I will read the file. In other words, this bit of code will return the content of the file. And now, as before, we can use the XML to dict library and the method parse to convert the XML to JSON. And then, as before, I will call json.dump to convert the Python object to JSON and then bring the JSON to the console. So let's execute this. Um, perfect, we converted the XML from a file to JSON. Let's see now how to do this same conversion but using the Untangle library. This library is not a built-in library, so we will first use the pip tool to install the library. Untangle is very similar to the previous library. If we want to convert XML, all we need to do is to import the library and then call Untangle and then parse. And add the XML information that we want to convert. A nice thing about Untangle is that it allows you to access the data easily. So if, 
For instance, we want to access the name of the employee, you will say object dot and then use the field names which are employees, then employee, then name and last C date to access the text inside the name tag. So if we print this and execute it, our program will print the employee name which is Dave in this case. Perfect, we have now converted XML to JSON using the XML to Date library and also the Untangle library. Next, we will see how to do the conversion using Pandas. Pandas is a very popular library in data science and is often used for data cleaning. It supports reading CSV format and also JSON format out of the box. However, XML reading is not supported out of the box, but there is a library available which is called pandas underscore read underscore XML. So let's install the library so we can use it. Now using pandas, we can convert the XML to JSON using just three lines of code. First, import the library. Next, call the read underscore XML method which will read the XML inside the file and convert it to a pandas data frame. And now we can convert the data frame to JSON using the toJSON method. So let's print it and execute it. And perfect! There we have our information in JSON format. Please note that the pandas read XML need other libraries like pandas, numpy, and a few more, so your program will take a lot more memory. So if your program is already using pandas, then this approach will make sense. However, if you just need to convert XML to JSON, I will recommend using the other libraries because your program will be lighter. Alright, so far we have seen how to convert the XML to JSON using the XML to DIT library, also using the Untangle library, and also using the Pandas library. So the last approach is doing this conversion using the Beautiful Soap library. The Beautiful Soap is a library mainly used to parse XML, but you can install an extra library called LXML to extend the functionality of Beautiful Soap so it can parse XML. First, let's install the library using pip. So we will run pip install Beautiful Soap and then pip install LXML. Once you install the libraries, we will import Beautiful Soap and also the JSON library. And next, I will create a beautiful soap object and pass two arguments, the file that contains the XML and the format that we are using, which in this case is XML. And save the results in a variable called XML underscore parser. Now, using this object, we can extract any value we want from the XML document. For instance, we can extract the employee name or the role. And use those values and save them in a JSON object. And last, use the JSON.dump to convert the Python object to JSON. So let's print this and execute it. And awesome, our XML is converted to JSON. So we reached the end of the video where we have seen how to convert XML to JSON in Python using four different libraries. The XML to Did library, the Untangle library, also we have used the Pandas library, and last we saw how to convert XML to JSON using the beautiful SOAP library. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.